Okay, here we are. This is time-lapse drawing a Toyota 2000 GT. This is lesson four. And what I've started to do is I'm doing the numbers on the side of the car inside the number dot. And it, they're not as dark as they're going to be finally because they actually are black, but I'm just ghosting them in so that you can see where, where we're working from. And, okay, there's the two. It's about done. And now the three, working on it. Also, like I said, I was going to do, uh, I'm going to do the number on the hood as well. And here I'm preparing to do the blue, that's the color of the hood. I'm reserving the areas around the pop-up headlights so that I can make sure that I can make those uh, stand out enough to tell people that they are actually there. Okay, doing most of this hood now. And I'm leaving the number dot alone there for now too. All I'm going to do is put the numbers inside of it also. I'm just doing the outside of it uh, by leaving it white. And again, these this is not as dark as the hood will actually be in, uh, by the time the drawing is done, but it's just to start so that I can see where everything is, just to get me oriented with... Uh, with how the drawing's going to go. A lot of these things are going to be much, much darker. Uh, the lower portion of the of the uh, hood, just over the grill area there, is, is fairly, fairly dark, just like it is over the right headlight. So uh, I'm going to come back and, and put several more shades of, of uh, ink on there, layers if you want to call it that, or a higher concentration, whatever you want to say. Okay, coming along great so far. There aren't too many changes. Most of that's basically one color. There are a couple highlights on the hood, but, but they're not light enough that I, I need to erase anything or leave them actually white. So uh, other than the headlights, I, I went ahead and put everything in on more or less one base coat that it'll work out okay and there are hinges on the hood too and uh, you can just barely see them on either side of the number dot but for right now I didn't do those uh, when it's darkened then those will be quite a bit more obvious so at that point then I'll have to take care of those and make them uh, make them a little bit better better understood but for now they're doing fine so I'm happy with them Okay, just about done here on the hood. And now I'm going to do the number in the number dot on the hood, just like I did on the door. And this number 23 is quite famous too. I found quite a few pictures of it on, on the internet when I googled uh, 2000, Toyota 2000 GT so I guess it, it really is one of the biggies for them for the factory itself okay just finishing that up now I'm gonna work on the tire and this tire is the left front and it is underneath the car completely with no light on it so I'm gonna really darken this up it's gonna be basically the same color as the shadow under the car and uh, I don't like to draw tire treads like I said so Usually I put the tire treads in full shadow and that's what I'm doing here is putting the whole wheel in this case because there's no light that's reflecting off of it. So that's uh, that's what I'm doing here. And uh, to me this really sets off a car, especially a light car, to have a dark undercarriage on it. And we'll be doing more of the undercarriage or the frame if you want to call it that underneath the car tomorrow. And uh, then I'll probably start with the the background also if we get enough time 
the background's going to be fairly dark because the car, like I said before, is white and I'm going to have a problem trying to illustrate that. So um, I'm going to make a dark background and then that will set off the white car. That'll give me a lot of answers to a lot of questions that I had otherwise. Anyway, coming along fine now. I'm just about done with the tire. And yeah, coming down toward the end. Um, I hope to see you back tomorrow because we're going to be doing a lot of work, maybe even a little bit longer lesson tomorrow. But uh, I think you'll enjoy it because it's going to show a lot of action and a lot of ink. Thanks. Bye.